Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Up until now in our videos, we have discussed how we can develop machine learning models for hydrological uses. If you have not yet seen the videos, you can find the link of them in the description. In the current video, we will discuss about coupling hydrological models, which can be used for understanding complex variables to get a higher model accuracy. So this is what we'll be discussing in this video, how to combine a singular model with another kind of a model or a concept to have a better accuracy so let's get into the video the first thing we'll discuss about is what are singular models and how they are different from the couple models as the name states singular models follow a single framework of concept to understand the data in the case of our domain an example for these models are the concepts which we have discussed in the previous video as you can see here these are the ones which we have discussed for developing hydrological models using ELM and other neural networks. The aim of these models is to be able to now cast or forecast various data sets like precipitation, discharge or any other hydrological or meteorological variables and based on the accuracy of these models uh, they are used for future works. Although these uh, singular models show higher accuracy and performance for most of the cases but when coming to understanding the hydrological uh, relationship between complex variables there are some limitations and hence they are not very dependable. To have a model to be able to understand these uh, complex relationships between the independent and dependent variables a new concept has been introduced. So that new concept is termed as a couple model or a hybrid model. These models are adopted and tested for various relationships to be able to develop a good model. So using the advantages of both the singular models and the concept of another model, a hybrid model is generated and a higher model performance is expected. So now coming to the definition of a couple model or a hydrological model, as the name states itself, these models are developed by combining two singular models or two different concepts to understand this complex relationships. So to understand this complex uh, relationship and develop a strong trait, the advantages of two models are combined thereby developing a unique model. Many methods of combining two models are adopted in various domains of research. So some of the methods which are used in our domain are combining a physics based model and a machine learning model so that the accuracy of a physics based model in terms of understanding the relationship of various variables and the faster performance of a machine learning model is combined to be able to develop a hybrid model which has both the advantages of a physics based and machine learning models. So this is one of the main topic of research which is going on nowadays in this domain. Also in terms of uh, a machine learning model to have a better performance, understanding the variations of data at various frequencies and times using a wave of sinusoidal form or other forms in terms of wavelets or Fourier transforms is one of the method which can be used for improving the accuracy of a machine learning model. So these are the two examples which we can discuss in future videos to see how a singular model when combined with a concept of another model can produce a unique hybrid model with a higher accuracy. So this is the concept of a hybrid or a coupled model and in our next videos we will be discussing about the concept of wavelets and how we use that concept to combine the wavelet to a machine learning model. That is it for this video. If you understood the concept, give this video a like, subscribe to the channel and share it with friends whom you think this information is useful.